Recently, there's been a lot of talk going about the Stabby Star. So why exactly are we so interested in it? Let's find out. Tabby star or KIC8462852 is a F-type main sequence star. It's approximately at a distance of 1280 light years from the Earth and is located in the constellation of Cygnus. This star caught the astronomers' attentions when they observed that this star was undergoing unusual light fluctuations. It occasionally dims as much as by 20%. When the astronomers pointed the telescopes toward the star, they noticed the light coming from the star was dipping in its intensity. The first dip was observed on 5 March of 2011 when it dimmed as much as by 15%. The second dip was observed on 28 February of 2013 when it dimmed by 22%. And more recently, a significant new dimming event began in May 2017. However, it's not the only star that has large irregular dimmings. Another star by the name EPIC 20427-8916 also has some unusual light fluctuations. There have been many hypotheses put forward by astronomers to explain this phenomenon. An astronomer named Jason Wright put forward a hypothesis that the star might still have a coalescing material around it. However, the NASA IRTF found no evidence of a coalescing material. Hence, his hypothesis was proven wrong. Another theory was about this disintegrating comets around the star. The existence of a large cloud of comets was doubted by the astronomers. However, the cloud cannot obscure for the 22% of the star's observed luminosity and also no such evidence was found of such a large comet cloud. Another hypothesis states about the consumption of a planet by the star. In December 2016, it was proposed that the increase in the brightness of the star was due to the release of the gravitational energy. And also, the planetary debris which is still in the orbit of the star might be causing the drops in its brightness. Next hypothesis deals with the existence of an alien megastructure such as a Dyson Swarm. The Dyson Swarm is a megastructure that the advanced civilizations might be using to tap the energy of the stars. And like all scientific theories, this theory is also a scientifically valid one because it is easily falsifiable. However, there is no sufficient evidence to prove the existence of such a structure. In October of 2015, the SETI Institute used the Allen Telescope Array to look for radio emissions from the star. However, no narrowband radio signals were found, negating the presence of any advanced civilization around the star. And recently, on May 14, 2017, the starlight began to dim again. And this helped the astronomers worldwide to collect data in real time on the unique star. And as of now, we don't know what's causing the star to dim. We need more data to gather evidence. It might be the comets, it might be the planets around the star, or it might even be the advanced civilizations. Or is there any other reason? Well, thanks for watching. Do subscribe.